You know her from Transparent and The Office, and now Melora Hardin is in a new series that's empowering women. She plays the boss in The Bull Type, a character we can all look up to and learn from. My kids' school has just shut down, and they are predicting more snow within the next hour, which means that the buses and the subways are going to be affected. So I think everybody should work from home. Wait, even me? Especially you, Andrew. Well, Laura, I love the bull type, and the number one reason is the representation of women working. Um, thank you so much. <laughs> is that, is that a, a big part of why you are part of this project? Absolutely. That was, you know, coming off of Transparent, um, I just realized that I, the next thing I wanted to do, I really wanted it to be something that was going to do good in the world in the same way that, you know, Transparent really did such good things in the world. And I felt like um, the bold type was a great picture of women um, in positions of power. Well, for me, my character, a, a powerful woman who is also a kind woman and has integrity and has, you know, has um, morals and is not cutting off her young employees at the knees all the time. Um, I think that so often we have pictures of women in the workplace who are good at what they do. And if they're good at what they do and powerful at what they do, they usually have a completely broken love life or they're just complete <laughs> So I didn't want, I just really was attracted to the fact that Jacqueline Carlisle is really She's really more like all the women I know in my life who are successful women who are balancing friendships and relationships and they're kind and they're good friends and, you know, young women, you know, who will often say, you know, you're my favorite character on the show because I want a boss like you or I want to be a boss like you. And I just think, yeah, I mean, that's the reason I'm doing the show, you know, for, for people to see that and to see the young women the way that they support and love and empower one another as well. And they also know how to ask for help. They know when they should turn to Jacqueline and be like, your years of experience are gonna inform us about this particular challenge. And she wants to be a mentor. I'm like, thank you. Someone yeah. who is powerful, successful, they wanna bring somebody else up with them. I love right. that. <laughs> we, need, we need women. It's so interesting because you really hear a lot of men talk about the people that mentored them. But personally, I mean, I've been acting professionally since I was six years old. You know, my mother was an actor, my father too. So I, I definitely had a lot of support. But um, as far as a mentor goes, I don't think I even knew how to, I didn't even know what that was. Yeah. <laughs> you know? And I think men are kind of more um, targeted towards finding people that can do that for them. And I really love that about Jacqueline. I want young women to see that and go, I'm going to find, I'm going to find myself a mentor and then go and ask that woman. But it's really wonderful to see strong people, strong women who are really coming from a loving place, navigate challenges with heart and with integrity and with intelligence. And then also I got to direct an episode this season, which was, which was fantastic or this part of the season. Um, and it was just such a joy to do that. And, and in that episode, uh, we all, we all get, uh, well, the title kind of tells what happens snow day. So it's, <laughs> it's kind of like we get stuck and, uh, you know, all the drama that ensues because of that, because of everybody being in one place. <laughs> well, congratulations on directing the episode. Thank you so much for having a character that has some value for women in the workplace. Like, I, I love that so much. I love that narrative. That's so wonderful. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for acknowledging that and, and for yeah. seeing that. And I love that it's doing that for you and for so many women and um, just makes me so happy. And yeah, thank you for having me. It was so nice to see you. <laughs> Good to see you too. Thank you.